everyone that found love this year, um, but we're also happy uh, for people that didn't because uh, it means you could keep f***ing. Um, it sounds like, yeah, you go, you, 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 you guys, uh, um, have you guys done some swinging over here? Or? Yeah. Yeah. He, he <laughs> this guy has taken down this entire table. <laughs> he, he may have even taken down people in the back of the room. Uh, I, actually, I do have a question for the crowd. Um, uh, is there anyone here from Berlin, Germany? We do have a fan from Amsterdam who flew in. Yeah, is he me... out there? Raise your hand. You flew from in. From Amsterdam. Clap it up for this guy. Glenn. And wait a minute. Did you fly from Amsterdam to come to updating? Yeah. Oh. oh. You flew. Yeah, you probably spent, what was that, a $1,000 flight? He's rich. <laughs> We'll do a shot with him after the show for we'll, flying in for, yeah. Oh, totally. Clap well, it up for that one. That's crazy. Uh, Harrison, are, are you excited, man? I mean, I'm excited. It's emotional ending the year. Who wants us to end the year with, uh, with these two taters going home tonight and having a little sex? Who wants that to happen? All right. Give it up for Lauren. Man. Lauren, yes. welcome to Updating. What's the perfect guy right now that we're going to bring out for you? Talk about exactly the guy you want. Um, someone confident and has their shit together, for sure. Someone maybe more dominant and, like, has leadership qualities. <gasps> and, and, yeah, and do you funny. Like, funny, you like brunette or blonde guys? Um, it doesn't matter. Or redheads? No. Even, okay. even redheads? <laughs> Unfortunately, no. Um, what hairstyle are you most turned on by? I like long. Long, long little. <laughs> like, they can do like a little. Wow. Flip. And Lauren, do you like a guy who makes, we're in New York City, the heart of the, fin the financial capital in the world. Do you care if a guy makes a lot of money? Yeah. It's a good question, Harrison. It's important. Because it's important to yes. me. Yes. It is. Oh. So it is important. Yeah, yeah. And so then what profession would be like a, an attractive one for like, a guy to have. I think I don't even want to know. Like they say something, 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 and I'm like, oh yeah. And it's just, it's, it's happening. <laughs> for sure. I have one question. Would you rather a doctor or a lawyer if you had to pick between the two? Um, maybe a lawyer. Okay. And a, and a lawyer is a hot profession. Yeah. And it, it is, and they make good money. Yeah, sure. Yeah. I mean, Harrison. I mean, uh, Brandon. Uh, Lauren, you seem really cool, really interesting. You seem cool. What's something that could surprise the crowd about you? Something from your past, something from your family? Okay, some people have braces, and some people have retainers. Yeah. I've had a lot of cavities. That's... How? It's my flaw. How many? Well, I said doctor, lawyer. What about a dentist? You turn on by that? Oh, my God. <laughs> That's my nightmare. Is that your is... Name? How many, wait, how many cavities have you no, had? No, like too many. It's like, embarrassing. Like over 100? No. Like, like, that's an interesting thing. Like, you, we, we, I, I'm so sorry that so many It kind of makes me sad. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of cool, though. Like, never so, had braces. You never had braces? No. Well, well I, I hope, look, I hope the cavities, uh, I hope they go down in the next couple of years. We're good. We're at 20, oh, sorry. At this age, we're good. Yeah, don't worry. It's all good. We didn't Has, think you were in your 40s. <laughs> do, do cavities affect the way you kiss at all? No, isn't it better? Oh. They say. They say it's better. How's it? But wait, because you feel more? Yes. So it, sensitive. You're very sensitive. It, yeah. So, that, <laughs> so, that, so what, um, I guess with this guy... What would be something that would fucking... Because you seem pretty... You have specific answers. So what would really bother you about this guy right now? One, someone who, like, underestimates me. I hate that. What are you doing? It's not for me. Okay. Um, or someone... This is, like, half a joke, but also very serious. Like, someone who doesn't have TikTok. Like, just get on the, get on the train. <laughs> it's not COVID anymore. Just have TikTok. Wow. What are you doing? That's... Show of hands, who doesn't have TikTok Yeah, make here? some noise. Just download it. Like, I don't understand. A make lot of people don't. noise if you don't have it. All right, we're going to bring out Lauren's date, but I think we should keep Lauren out here, but not tell her date. So, Lauren, move over one seat to your right, and don't say a peep when we speak to this guy, because we're going to really break into it with him. We're going to break him down. Sure. We're going to, yeah. He won't know. Here, I'll take that. I'm sorry. I acted as if you could say. All right, so go right there. <laughs> and yeah, you just won't. So, 
Harrison. All right, I have a man. <laughs> and this man's name is Michael. Guys, give it up. Oh, my God. Michael, Michael, Michael. Look at this. Oh, my God, he's got nice. I like that. Okay. All right, so Michael. Um, How's it going? We're so excited to meet you. Um, so right off the bat, uh, Michael, um, wow, I like your hair. Oh, wow, okay. <laughs> what do you want to say to the crowd right now? What do you want to say, what motherfucker? What do you want? Yeah. What I want to say to the crowd is thank you all for being here, and I'm, I'm just happy to be in front of you. <laughs> Michael. And Michael, we don't normally do this on our show. We don't, and you, um, uh, we don't do usually like profession. But I am curious because you, you know, I'm, I'm looking at you, um, and I know Harrison wants to know your profession. What is it? I'm a lawyer. <gasps> oh my! Yo, clap louder! <laughs> and would you describe yourself as a lawyer? who loves what he does or a lawyer that cares more about making a lot of money? Oof. <laughs> Let's say 50-50. Oh, oh, my God. What, what, a, what a lawyer. How does uh, being a lawyer affect your <laughs> dating life? Well, the hours aren't great, but the dinners I can afford are. <gasps> You, what's the so? Wow. So, guy like you, you like the girl. What are you dropping on? Tell me how much you're gonna spend on a nice dinner. Well, the most I ever spent, which was a big mistake of mine, was about 400. Oh shit! On just one person? I was hoping you wouldn't ask that. Yes, that was per person. Oh my god. Um, I, I, this guy. I know. By the way, I will say, Michael, what just made you humble is you're in a room in New York and you said the most you've spent is 400. There are probably assholes here that have spent 3,000 ahead. Um, that, if, yeah, that would uh, hit harder in Cleveland. Yeah. You know, than... <laughs> in Cleveland, they'd be like, what did you just buy Arby's? Or... <laughs> it's like, it's like $10,000 for a house there. And Michael, on, on these very expensive dates that you're going on, what uh, are you calling the Uber home? What's your strategy going into a first date? Because you seem like a guy who thinks a lot before a date. Well, the Uber, see, that's a problem. Because you call the Uber, you stand there, and you wait. But if you look for a cab, it's a bonding experience. Oh, oh man. What's something that you normally don't share that you will because this is a, this is a unique situation you're right now, uh, you're in, this, you know, coming on the show? What's something you would tell the crowd that you would never, never wanted to tell anyone in your life? <laughs> I'm a big nerd, especially when it comes to classical novels. Well, we're gonna move past that. <laughs> I love that. Um, uh, well, Brandon, I was gonna attempt, be um, attempt, amend that question. Maybe a porn search that our boy Michael has looked up that maybe is. Something a little bit more, uh, you know, that a rich, a super rich guy like yourself would look up on porn. Yeah, what is that? Or you look it up on TikTok, huh? If I had to say, brunette, maybe. <laughs> wait, like brunette? Wait, wait, you typed in on porn, brunette. <laughs> That is the most broad, especially in 2024, when you can type in like motherfucking son while stepson walks in. <laughs> you typed in, in, you type in brunette. So you don't like blondes? No, it's not that I don't like br blondes at all. It's just that I'm not very picky when it comes to my porn. That, that's very uh, specific. Wait, though. I like, he really is a lawyer. He knows how to walk around and answer. Uh, <laughs> final question for you. Are you on TikTok or nah? I'm not on TikTok now. <laughs> well, don't worry, because you're in, in in the presence of a big audience and a lot of people, um, you know, uh, are baby boomers. So, um, all right, Michael, uh, put your hand uh, to the right. Oh. 
Hej. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Sup? I'm Michael. <laughs> I'm Lauren. Good to meet you, Lauren. Great to meet you. Were you here the whole time? <laughs> <laughs> I heard everything you said. Ah, yeah, well. I was here. Yeah. Tell me something about yourself. <laughs> He's a lawyer. <laughs> Like, if I get sued, what? I'll call you up. Um, I don't, about me? I'm yeah. Lauren, from LA. I'm like a fun, independent, <laughs> funny girl. Ha ha ha. Yeah, that's about me. I have a big family. I like to play sports. I like to sing. Yeah. What do you sing? <laughs> Anything. Anything really. I mean, Let's hear it. No. Sing. No, that, that's not gonna happen. Sing. Uh, sing. This audience loves sing. Sing, sing. I don't know about y'all, but I don't know about us. What do you want to say? Are we gonna do it? Do it with him. Michael, do the fucking duet. Let's do it. I mean, I'm the worst singer in the world, but sure, That's why fine. not? Let's cut you that. What do Michael you say? seems like a guy who would sing Sinatra, probably. Yeah, let's sing. <laughs> yeah, Michael, Climbing I feel the like. Moon? You know it? I am the worst music no, lyrics person in the world. Together. Just go da 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 da, you know? Da 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 da. <laughs> it's, I, think it's the duet's, I think the duet's done. Yeah, it probably should be. I'm the worst singer ever. You know, it's funny. You're the worst singer, Michael, but you have a, uh, if you weren't a lawyer, you could have been a phone sex operator. He's like, <laughs> he's like, he's like um, uh, I like the way. So can you say something? So you do actually have a very, you do, I'll be honest. Um, it's, I know you look up brunettes. I look up um, uh, men with really deep voices <laughs> fucking. Um, uh, so do you uh, want to say something kind of uh, that would turn uh, Lauren on in that deep voice? Like, what would pop into your head, boy? <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, Lauren, the only thing I can say is I will buy you any bottle of wine you'd like and take you out to dinner wherever you want, and it will be the best evening we'll have. Dude, I gotta be honest, that deserves a wow, well, it's beautiful. I mean, this... and would you spend more than $400 on Lauren? Based on this, yes, I will. And, and then what, and then I love what you said, but then I guess in a more sexual way, what would you say? <laughs> So to answer that same question in that in that type of way, what would you say? Just just so we could get past that and really find out about you. What, what would you say there? Read her the Miranda rights. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> yeah, what would you say, Mr. Lawyer there? See, I wish I could see her eyes, but I have a feeling that Lauren over here is a very beautiful woman. And I would compliment the first thing that I saw. Oh. And then I would make it sexual to whoever said that right there. Whoever said that gets a gets a, a dildo. Okay, uh -huh. Lo that was good. Lauren, do you have any any questions for Michael about maybe his money or? Um, no, I, I honestly, no, not like that. But do you have a question? Oh. If you carried around a purse with you, what would be in it? Whoa. That's actually a really good question, and I'm Thank very you. lucky that I have a younger sister. All right. So my wallet, my phone, my keys, pepper spray, <laughs> and item number five. You, a you forgot to say a checkbook. <laughs> no, probably uh, probably my attorney secure pass. So I can get into court. I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be lame. <laughs> What about a condom? Uh -huh. Condom goes in your back pocket, Harrison. And do you... Uh -huh. Wow. Anything else you want to know about this guy? Is it oh. a decision? Um, sure. Um, what do you listen to when you're walking outside? That'll be... Michael. I listen to, honestly, old 80s music. I'm a, I'm a classic rock guy, and I'm from Long Island, like this guy over here. So I listen to Billy Joel a lot. Yes. Queen, ABBA, all the 80s music. Yes. 
Brandon, uh, uh, the chemistry's going on. There is something happening, but there's a guy in the crowd who wants to swoop Lauren away. <laughs> and I think we should have him make an argument. That was supposed to be a lawyer joke. Okay. <laughs> um, he should plead his case why Lauren should pick him. Oh, my All God. All right, is there, is there a Christian in the crowd? You're going to have one minute to steal this date. Christian. Where are you? Where the fuck? Oh, this guy. Oh, shit. Come over here. Come over here. Wow. Wait. Oh, what? Good damn, bro. Damn. All right. So, everyone, pipe down and face them, Christian. Because they... All right, no one speak. Let this guy... All right, so, uh, Christian... Um, give your case. What's your pitch um, to Lauren here? So honestly, I was sitting with your friends. That's the first thing. Oh my God. All right. Do the friends approve? Woo! <laughs> oh, no, she does it. She does it. She hates you. Apparently. No, she does. Why don't you like this guy? What bothers you about him? That is not right for your friend. Say it. I love him, oh. but. But. I know my friend very well. And I just don't think that their values align. Where are you from? Wait, where are you from? <laughs> Australia. You found a lot about his life out pretty quickly. We're best friends and we adore each other. Oh, you know him? No. No, no, no. She knows her. Okay, but you said, but you don't know his value. You just met him. Chris, right? So come over yeah. here. They're not right for each other. Wait, I'm oh. just saying they're not right for each other. All right. Okay. Let, Christian, maybe Christian, start off. come over here. Don't and worry. Start off, start off with your values. Let's hear about you. What are you? <laughs> Yeah, what are your values? So you're a piece of shit. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, probably. Um, no, yeah, no. What are your values? Um, honestly, uh, yeah. man, Please. listen. Don't ha calm down there. No okay. age, no no job. So uh, I'm looking for a person that is. Wait, very... that was cool, man. He's following the rules when I didn't yeah. even ask. <laughs> Dude, he he listens, bro. I do. It's my third show, so. Oh, thank you for supporting. Of course. Oh, good man. So, uh, I'm looking for a person that is very goal-oriented. Uh, I have been keep going, figuring myself out over the past couple years. Oh. Uh, what, and what went wrong that you had to figure out? Uh, oh, oh, she, uh, she uh, went for my best friend. Oh. Yeah. Wait, she want? Can you repeat that? My you, ex. Yeah. Years ago, one for my best friend. Are she while you were dating her? Yeah. Did you? Oh, it was terrible. It was did terrible. You, wait, did you walk in on her? Uh, oh yeah. Uh, oh, you, you guys are gonna love this. <laughs> <laughs> the dildo that I bought her was in his ass. Oh my god. you handle this situation? Oh, I fucking left for the military. I went to fucking Japan for three years. I lived my life. And did, and did, he, wow. did you see his dick? Uh, no, I, I didn't see his dick. I saw his balls, you know, from the behind. Do you think, who do you think was bigger, him or you? Uh, that's a uh, plea the fifth, like this guy. <laughs> This is a, a... I like his values, honestly. Hey. <laughs> no, 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 honestly, honestly, I'm up here. I'm pre I, 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 I was sitting with her friends. They said, she will never like you, and I want to prove them wrong. Yo! No! 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 So, so I'm Chris, a big fan so, of this guy. So, Christian, that, yes. 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 Deli <laughs> deliver the final, the final speech to Lauren. Say, Lauren... Here's why your friends are wrong about me. So Start Lauren, off with that, Lauren. Yes, 100%. Your friends are wrong about me because I may be a short guy, but I know what I'm doing. I have my head on my shoulders. I have a great job. Yeah, sure. Rent is high. I live with my parents. Fuck it. But, but I just got out of the military. I just got out of the military a year ago. And I promise you, a year from now, Things will be a lot different. Oh my God! Yo! Harrison, Christian, 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 Christian! Oh my God! I'll tell you something, Christian. Um, we've been doing the show a long time now. 
We've done a lot of shows. Several, uh, I, hundreds. Okay. Se- hundreds. I have never in my life seen a pitch of that. Le- uh, you are the most confident guy. I, I have nothing to fucking fear. Yo, I'm going to tell you something. Not whatever happens here, I'm going to introduce you to all my friends because you'll fit in with us. Oh, <laughs> sounds like a plan. Sounds I, like a plan. I love right? Christian. I'm down with it. I love this and guy and what he just did. I'm buying you guys a beer after the show. I will. No, I, well, that was my final question. If you were to take Lauren out, how much would you chop for her? <laughs> yeah. Cool. Um, let's just put it this way. I can't talk about my profession. All I can say is there's a rooftop that I could get on with no fucking issues. Oh my God. All right, so here's what you're gonna do. Hang on, what? You're gonna get a stool stool for him, Harrison. I mean, you... Guys, show some love for that pitch, won't we? No, sit sit directly next to her. Sit, yeah, fate, perfect. All right, so, Lauren. (laughs) <laughs> All right, so you haven't even seen this guy. Everyone, everyone, please pipe down. This is about to get very serious. Please, this is uh, what Christian just did is something I, I, don't, I don't have words of appreciation. Um, so, Lauren, um, you have not seen him yet. Okay. Correct. From Christian's bold, prolific pitch that's going to go down in updating history. Um are you interested in Christian? Yes or no? Um, <laughs> Christian has a charisma that I like. And it's definitely, I like it way more after. <laughs> oh! Oh! But I need, I need someone out of mommy's house. I'm so sorry. Oh! So blind, so blindfolds off everyone up here, and then and then Christian talk it out um, with her. All right, so everyone and, take your blindfolds. And, and before they come off, it seems like you're picking Michael Lauren. You could either hug or kiss him if you want. With uh, up, oh, she already took it off. Yeah, do, you, do you want? Oh, don't look. She didn't look at. Do you want to kiss? Wait, do you, wait, Lauren. Do you want to kiss Michael? Wait, no, I don't want. Ki- no. <laughs> <laughs> wait, but if I had to pick between the two? If you had to pick between the two. Oh, him. Uh-huh. Oh! Yo, what? what? Hey. Yo, what? No, I'm, I'm picking Christian. I'm so sorry, uh, but he's much more exciting. Okay. <laughs> so take your blindfolds off, everyone up here. All right, Christian. So, Lauren, look at Christian, Hello. please. Hi. Hello. Hi. So what do you think? It's not for me. I told I, you said pick one or the other. So which one are you gonna pick? Him. I'm so sorry. But uh, um, what don't you like about Michael? Just tell him what you don't like. Well, to be fair, I don't care that much about money. I'm just saying have it. But I'm. But I don't. The way he was talking about like going like four hundred dollars at dinner. I don't care. We can go to CBK. Like I don't care. Oh my god. Yeah. Hell yeah. I, I care. I do. I'll be honest. I want someone to spend that on me. Uh, yeah, like it's nice. It, it's, so, so Christian, how do you feel? Um, so it looks and, like you got her. Dad. And, and Michael. I mean, hey, listen. At the end of the day, you know what? <laughs> this is updating. Oh. Okay? She can say yes today. She can say no tomorrow. Whoa. So wow. wow. That was meta. <laughs> that was meta. I, I, I'm not expecting that. I'm uh, glad you're listen, a fan of the show, because that I was the coolest the thing we've ever heard. Honestly. Uh, I'm going to be a straightforward person every single fucking day. Uh, she may like me today. She may not like me tomorrow. Uh, and, Ma- I, and, uh, and Michael, uh, Michael, your uh, closing argument, you're about to... Your closing argument, what do you have to say? My closing argument for Lauren or La- total? To Lauren. She just chose the other guy. Yeah. To so Lauren, I feel like their uh, question was a little bit biased, but I would like to get to know you better if you had more time. Yes! So... So Lauren, you guys really hate me, don't you? Oh, uh, don't worry about, <laughs> don't worry about them there, Christian. We'll get to you. Okay. So Lauren, he, I, so my, Michael actually just did something very cool. He legitimate. He asked you out in a real way. He goes, you know, that may, it, you know, my, he's obviously on a show. It didn't go in a direction. He, uh, you know, the lawyer, lawyers like to steer their direction. So, mm-hmm. um, would you be down to go on a date with him? 
I'm all right. Thank you. It's okay. Oh, I'm crazy. Now, how would you like dinner with me? <laughs> this is going to work for you. Like, keep it going, but it's not for me either. Whoa. 